Luca Vicento. Get that hook grip in place. Only hook grip. You got it? Feeling it, baby. It's Saturday Weightlifting Club, and look who it is. Look at this fella. He's changed his haircut now, but you might remember him from videos such as What Saves the Day 2017. He got, oh my god, he's actually got the same t shirt as he did like eight years ago when I made the first video. Probably got the same bacos on as well. But yeah, we're on Weightlifting Club, hitting the second pull right now. Quite well. We're going through the snatch, um, and then we're just going to fuck around and do some bodybuilding. We literally haven't trained together for like four years. And now look at us back in the gym. Back in the gym, we both lost about... Back in the gym, there's about 20 kilos lost between us. That's it, so about 20 kgs. When we first met, when we were 18, you wouldn't have thought, like, ah, this is going to be the heaviest I'm going to be, and the strongest at age 18. Look at us now, we're like 20 kilos down, and lifting what is seems to be just the bar but yeah it's Saturday club and we're skinny boys and we're happy if it says rack it means it's recording Struggle your shoulders more. That's better. Give me a snatch flick. <laughs> this kid loves snatch. Loves snatch, man. Shagging it. You might be wondering why I'm stood outside and um, it's freezing cold. It was like two degrees last night when I stood outside in my shorts and shit. Basically, I bottled doing cold showers. I absolutely bottled it. Partly, um, well, it's meant to help with the angst bond, but I did it for like two days, the Wim Hof method, and I was just like in dire pain, and I was like, okay, maybe that was a bit too fast, too soon. So I'm, instead, I'm stood outside in the freezing cold. I'm gonna go get in the sun in a moment, but um, I'm just setting this up so you can actually see me, so I don't have to hold the camera. Basically, just showing off how much of a fucking weirdo I am, and um, yeah, because. Most people don't really want to go outside, do they, in the freezing cold? Um, yeah, daylight, cold therapy. I am cold, that's why I'm talking like this. Um, Energising, all that good stuff. Just give it a go, get outside. Hopefully it will help with some things. But yeah, I was, I was hoping it will be really sunny. <laughs> but it's only mildly sunny, so I was about to bottle it and be like, Nah, I'm gonna go back inside and wait till it's sunny. But I've built up the energy to do it. Um, so I was like, fuck it, I don't care if there's a mild bit of cloud. Let's go outside. Probably gonna sit in a deep squat, wait for my sister to come out and laugh at me. Um, but hey, who's winning? I'm getting daylight, I'm getting the real vitamin D. Might get some vitamin D directly to the SI joint. Do you reckon that's how you fix it? This is how you fix ankles and spondylitis. You go outside in the cold and you just vitamin D your arse cheeks and that all fuse back the SI joints. No need for surgery. That is not actual advice. Maybe it is. I'm going to try it. I'm going to try it and um, I'll report back in three months of walking around the garden in just shorts when it's freezing cold in the sun. Um, I'll report back on that and let you know how I get on. And I have like massive calves and the most perfectly fused SI joints. So yeah. <laughs> oh, 
Hey, if you think I'm a weirdo, go and Instagram this guy called Certified Health Nut, and um, you'll find the photo um, where you'll see him. Um, what's it called? Sunbeat. No, nah, how would you say it? Sun tanning his asshole, effectively. So you'll lie in his garden, legs akimbo, asshole fully presented. And he's just sunning it. Apparently two minutes a day, according to him, is, is what you should do. So, I don't blame you if you're a bit worried and you're thinking, in a few videos time, I don't know what to expect from you, Savvy. I'm not too sure, I'm not too certain that I'm not gonna open the video of yours and it's gonna be your arsehole in the sun, but I'm gonna promise you that I won't do that. No, I can't promise you that. I definitely can't promise you that. I promise you that I won't put it on video. Okay, because if I'm going to start doing that shit, I'll just keep that to myself. But seriously, go and check out that guy. It's fucking weird. <laughs> weird, but hey, whatever works for you. Clothes are back on in the form of about 15 layers because it is actually Baltic today. Um, so yeah, I've come down to the front. I'm going to do a bit of a walk, make the most of the sun. Um, getting all those good Sunday feels in. I am on a, well it's quarter past 12 now, I'm, how many hours? 15 hours into a fast. Um, gonna go 18 hours, gonna eat just before the Liverpool game, like half three. Um, journal this morning, um, read a bit, chilled, meditated, um, been quite a, a nourishing Sunday, and the kind of Sunday I'm trying to have a lot more. Um, and yeah, when you've, you're battling a condition or autoimmune disease or just when you're trying to be optimal in your health, having some days when you like just take it a bit easy and you're not like on your phone all day, uh, you're not, well, fasting can be helpful. Again, someone that I'm kind of st only started recently, so I don't know whether it's massively helpful to me or not, but it, from what I've done so far, it's been helpful. Um, and yeah, that's what I should say as well. So try and be off my phone, no screens, no nothing at all until I eat again. So like till this evening, pretty much. Um, we are gonna go on a nice little stroll. Um, you have seen the clip last night from training with Cotton. Um, every week now, I think we're gonna try and train together and do some form of like, well, following a weightlifting program. Um, Cause I'm coached up in it now and he's he likes it and we used to do it and it's like a bit, a bit of nostalgia for us to be able to train together and um, and do some bicep curls at the end you know the typical typical bro shit that we used to do um, and just chat about random shit pretty much but um, yeah that was last night today is the full fasting day off phone day um, get it in the sun yeah and just having one of those Nourishing days, as I said before, nourishment is the key word here, it's the key feeling of today. 